Gary, it's good to see you. It's good to see you as well. How are you today? Doing great. Excited to be here. So at Open Metas, you guys spend a lot of time with Oracle service customers. And a lot is changing over the last few years. So what are you seeing? What, what are the key changes that you, you guys have observed? Um, how, how do you see the role of service agents change? What does it mean for service leaders in this new reality? Well, I think the remote workforce has had a sizable impact on the industry. Um, obviously, with a, a pandemic across the country, a lot of companies are sending their people to become at-home agents or setting up virtualized workforces. And that creates a specific set of challenges for any service organization that's really trying to personalize their service offering. Got it, right. Um, so, Garrett, Open Methods and Oracle Service have been working together for a long time with many great customer deployments, great success stories. So, share a bit about how the combination of Oracle Service and Open Methods works. Sure. Um, so, Open Methods really focuses on two primary areas. One is bringing all the communication channels into Oracle. So you don't have to answer a call on a different application and then alt tab into the CRM to start working with the customer. And the second is to really make that Oracle service cloud agent desktop, that single pane of glass for an agent. So they don't have to navigate between seven other or 10 other applications to solve a customer request. So Garrett, um... You talked a bit earlier about the virtualized workforce. Overnight, companies had to send the people home and still deliver great service experiences. How does the integrated solution between Open Methods and Oracle address those trends? So the two big challenges I see in, in going to a virtualized workforce, one is training. Without classrooms and being able to have hands-on training, how do you get your agents up to speed? And secondly is... Uh, around communication. When an agent has an issue, if they're in a call center, they can raise their hand. If they're at home, there's no supervisor to walk over and help them. And those are two areas that we can bring a lot of value. One is really around the UX design and automation. If you think about it, I often ask this to potential uh, customers, is how often do you train your customers to use your website? You don't. You rely on UX design, intuitive concepts, and you try to make it easy for them to navigate through. And that's really what we focus on, is if we can make the agent experience really easy so they don't have to navigate through multiple applications to try to find an answer or to try to, to process a service request, that'll make their job that much better. And that's super important, right? Because you know the new generations of agents, they were born with a phone in their hand. So they expect those applications to be as easy as Snapchat. Um, so let's talk a bit about business impact. What is the business impact of just doing this well? Everything that you just talked about. Well, doing it well is uh, obviously happy agents, you know, provide much better service. So if we can make their agent experience that much better, reduce handle time, improve occupancy, then not only do we save money, but we, we give a better experience for the end customer as well. So it's really, you know, it's a, more efficiently run operation, you have better agents with more information at their fingertips, and you have happier customers that are getting their questions or their service requests resolved very quickly. That's awesome. Can, can you give some examples of specific challenges that our customers face as your solution solves? Well, that's really at the base of what we do. We have two core products. Harmony, which is our multimedia bar, allows customers to orchestrate all of the interaction channels and deliver them all into Oracle, making voice native. If you have a third-party SMS like Twilio, we can make that native to Service Cloud. And it allows your workforce management system, which tells you how many people you need to staff with what skill at what time, to have all of the appropriate data so it can make those decisions accurately. The second thing we have is PopFlow, which is really around screen pop and workflow design. And that addresses the challenge that we had talked a little bit about earlier around UX design, making it easy for your agents. Similar to the way you know, your website is intuitive. Um, an agent though, when they are opening up a ticket, they might have to go to an e-commerce application to look up an order. They might have to go to a fulfillment to find out where that order is. 
with PopFlow, you can pull all of the relevant data that the agent would need to see when they need to see it without having to train them to navigate to these other systems. Got it. I think we're at the end here. So Garrett, uh, Oracle is super excited to have you guys as partners. Uh, we are very much looking forward to many, many more years of a great partnership. Thank you for your time today. Thank you. Have a great day.